Here is a well-known parable. A passenger used to stand up at every train station and inspect the view from his window. On his fifth time, the neighbor sitting next to him asked, What are you looking for? Do you not remember your stop? I simply don't know it yet. Not knowing the journey's end is a part of the excitement. So, why am I telling you this? The world our heroes have embarked upon is very deceptive by its nature. But, they can use the prophecies to shape the world. Why didn't I tell you that before? Well, I am getting old and forgetful. Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome to another episode of Void Drain. Uh, as you saw the little intro there, that's actually why I record the passage of the Void Gate. When I'm, whenever I'm starting the episode, I always record it just in case something like that does happen. And what do you know, the narrator showed up. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what he's referring to, or the game's referring to, I should say. Uh, it almost it's almost like the actions that I take affect the world as I pass through the void gate I could be wrong about that it could be just you know lore and all that stuff uh, had a little running with the the fishy gun eh, it was okay I almost shot this little guy here I felt bad about that but uh, no no harm done no damage done uh, what I'm doing is I'm trying to get up as much as I can because I want to start progressing a little more uh, I want to get some research done there's uh, one thing I'm need to unlock and that's the 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 thirst thing and I actually need dirty water for that so I want to get that I'm also being extra cautious in case those uh, those air sharks or whatever they are decided to come back uh, also as far as the train I did actually look into uh, the whole engine and stuff like that and apparently it's not about the the uh, status of the, the the wagon itself it's actually got to do with the number of wagons uh, right now uh, with the mechanical drive it's limited to the uh, capacity is three wagons so right now I have two uh, when I get to three wagons then I can have the option to upgrade this to the steam engine which gives me a capacity of five uh, five wagons and then uh, when you reach five wagons and you go up to diesel now I know diesel does require some sort of fuel uh, thought of that just scares me right now but I have a feeling a boiler might too so before I go into a steam engine I wanna you know at least stock up on what I can I don't really need that right now what I need is I need water I need copper or scrap and lots and lots of wood so I'm gonna do a little bit of gathering here and uh, bring you back when I'm ready to do something uh, right now our next next goal is to get to the next gate so I will bring you back if I see something interesting that's worth exploring. We'll go check it out. Anyway, I shall return. Okay, I'm back. So I went ahead and I gathered up a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, also, as you can see, I did some uh, a little bit of organization. Organization. I built three more, uh, or two more storage containers, and I built more, or uh, container shelf. Is that what it's called? Whatever. Anyway, I got uh, I got more storage, more organization. This is all going to be wood here. Uh, not too much right now. I've been trying to get get some stuff. I've cooked up some iron to to make the bolts and to make the shelves and the crates and all that other stuff. So it's needless to say, I've just spent the last 20 minutes getting storage. Uh, I do have to get some water and some food, as you can see on the lower left. But I do have enough to get some research done. And that's this one here. I've got 14 dirty ice. So we'll go ahead and research this. Uh, and I guess that just gives my, that allows my thirst to last longer. So what do we have? Driller, lump of ice, lump of coal. Ooh, where do we get this from? What's this for? Oh, we're gonna have to figure that one out. And what do we have here? Pressing coal briquette, just better fuel, I guess, and water bin. I uh, just guess holds water. We're gonna have to look into this. So, can I even make gears? Let's find out. Uh, be in here somewhere. 
Gear. Hmm. What do we need for it? Uh, four, six. Oh, pistons and that. Ooh. Although. I think we still gotta build it. Uh, we shall see, but definitely we're going to need coal for, obviously, the engine. So we're going to have to get this going before we upgrade to a steam, steam engine. All right, so that is that. i got to get some uh, vitals taken care of, and I'll be back later. Okay, I'm back. I have a whole bunch of stuff made up. Uh, as you can see, i got a whole box of iron here. i got some iron there. Uh, I do have to make some grease up. I have been uh, dealing with uh, the little pests here. Uh, while they're here, let's see if I can... Ah, too late. Anyway, uh, I find that if I just peg, peg one off, just like, as it's flying by, I usually tend to get the fat, so that is good. Um, what I do need to do is go and get all these chemicals that I have up here, because I keep forgetting about them. Because they're all the way up here where I don't even need them. Uh, eventually, like I said, I do want to get this cleared off, because this is where... We're gonna have a steam engine there eventually. Uh, I need to make chemicals. Okay, I got one chemical in the grease. Uh, I'm just gonna make a whole bunch of it because we'll need it eventually. Uh, I did have bolts. Uh, let's grab iron. I'll grab some iron. We need. Uh, what was it? It was two gears. Two gears. I have the bolts and two pistons. And pistons, I need the grease. The bolts are in here. Okay, so let's not do that. Okay, we'll go here, we'll make... Uh, go here, and yeah, consumables. Not consumables, whatever. Components. That's the word I'm looking for. Alright, there's that. There is the grease. And then, when this is done, then I can pick this up in uh, inventory space. <gasps> Always inventory space. Hang on a second. Spontaneous sneeze. That's always fun. Okay, uh, actually, let's get this in here. Let's free up some space. Take that, and we go ahead and make. Uh, I need. Is that? Oh, that's nothing. Oh, hang on. Follow up. This time I just muted that one. Alright, I need two pistons on this one, I believe. And I believe that is everything I need. Yes, I just need those two pistons and we get to this. And then I imagine it's going to be the same amount. Uh, I don't know if this is going to be like something I deploy or... I need fuel, of course I do. Alright, we'll put five wood in because I'm never going to use this again. Actually, that's not what I was looking for. <laughs> that's what I was looking for. Anyway, uh, okay. Do this. Oh. I'm curious about this. What is this going to be? And... Could almost do that. And I could actually do that. You know what? It's research. Okay, uh, four gears and one more grease. The grease is done. Okay, heavy objects. Uh, at some point you will find large pieces of resources such as ice or coal. If you don't already have it, uh... Oh, interesting. Okay, so that just means that I'm going to be able to find large chunks of ice and coal, which I need this this driller for. Now go here. Equipment is not in here. Tools, not in here. Um, so what is this? Is it something in... No. Ah, that's the wrong button. Is it in here? Oh, hello. It's a machine. Huh. And what do I need for it? The same thing I need for the research. It. <gasps> oh, lordy. Alright. Uh, let's actually see what I have for this. Okay, I need two pistons. So I need one more grease. Uh, I have enough. I will be right back. And there we go. There is the bolts. Now I'm not putting this going on for now. So let's open up the book and a driller. Alright, and this is a big boy. Alright. Cool. 
coal chunk and ice chunk. Huh. Interesting. I built something I have no use for right now. I do know I'd have to build the grappling hook, and I think that was yeah, that was in here. Uh, two, four, six, six iron and one copper. I don't have any copper at all, and I have no iron. I've got two gears. I made two gears too many. Uh oh. Anyway, uh, do I have any scrap in here? No, I don't. Okay, what was next in the research? That. Oh, that's what I need the gears for. And this. Let's actually see what this can do. Um, what is that green jar? That was over here. Unstable chemicals. Requires two. Sounds fun. Let's make it. Uh, I need more chemicals. Do -do -do -do. I'm going to regret not picking up any chemicals now. I'm going to start picking up more sooner or later. Uh, go to the lab and make some dangerous stuff. Make that. Then I need five dirty water. Which I used, so I'll have to <laughs> I'll have to bring you back for that one. Okay, I have everything now. So yeah, we were working on uh well let's first, first let's get this out of the way. So I got the dirty ice, I almost went and made water out of that. That would have been a bad thing to do. Well, not really. It just means more work. So I'll go ahead and uh, research this. So the water bidding, whatever this does, and then I need this. So I just need to make one more grease and two more sprockets or gears. I'll go here. We'll make uh, two gears. Like that, and then I need that. And do I have any chemicals here? Probably not. All the way at the front of the train. Or floating all around me because I never pick them up. And I'm empty again. I know, it probably would be quicker just to do it. run over there and do it. So we go here, we'll make one grease. That takes a second. We'll take that and uh, let's actually see if that bite, that bitten is in here. No, it's not. Is that a crafting thing? Like a, one of these things? Uh, it doesn't look like it. Hmm. Anyway, uh, is it something in here? No. And it's not in here. No. No. There's the armor plating, by the way. I'm not going to make that yet. Uh, nothing in here. Uh, I think I needed to make that. I'm not sure. Uh, oh yeah, that was for the grappling hook. Okay, I think I have... Yes, everything for this. Now, what does this unlock? Let's find out. The steam engine. So you do actually have to research it. Okay, that's interesting, but I can't actually use... I don't think I can actually use this until we get the third wagon. And as you can see, that is a lot of iron that we gotta... Got a scrounge. So, anyways, uh, that is that. I want to figure out what this whole bidden is about. Uh, see, it's, is it anything on me? Uh, no. It's nothing I can craft. Uh, maybe something in. Hmm. Let me look around. Well, a thought occurred, since it ha it's just before the steam engine, maybe it's got something to do with where the, the steam engine actually holds the water. So that is good to know. Uh, I have been try looking around trying to see if I could, you know, find somewhere to explore, and there has been a few areas where I've seen some of these stones, like, stray off of the distance, but I could get, to, like, one or two stones out, and I couldn't really get anywhere. Uh, so, anyway, what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to keep on rolling here, figure it literally and if i come across anything interesting i'll bring you back if not i'll see you at the next depot all right well i decided to do a little bit of exploring i saw some rocks down below the truck and i thought well maybe i'd look around and what do you know we got fireflies which is good too because i actually have some iron because i'm gonna have to make some more tethers because i am running low i don't have to don't have enough to get down there uh, I don't know if it's because I went down there that triggered them, or what, but 
Let's go, let's pull forward here. I did not expect to see them there. I was looking around for them. This isn't coincidental. I had no idea they were there. I was just gathering stuff and I'll uh, show you a little thing I learned with these guys here. Mm. You can slap them and then you, uh, you take them out and then you get usually pick up whatever uh, whatever you get from them. I didn't actually have anything on on them. So let me uh, craft up some more rings here and let's go exploring. Okay, I am ready. I have 38. I hope that's enough. Uh, I see the big taters there too, so that's always a good sign. Sorry, right, let's get out here. Let's disembark the train and continue on. Let's see where this leads us. Yeah, okay, it's not gonna work, so I gotta go to this one here. I'll make sure not to waste them this time. And I was gonna remember too if I can't actually reach my tether to look for one of these. So yeah, it looks like we're going this way. And let's continue on. Shouldn't take too long. Uh, I was also thinking too about the the parable that the, the narrator was giving us. Ooh, it's getting getting dark here. Um, hmm. But yeah, he was. Uh, what I think the narrator they were referring to was uh, as I unlock stuff. Uh, it sort of progresses the game, so uh, you sort of progress the storyline at your own pace, for instance, right? Uh, maybe once I unlock the steam engine and actually build something, and look, what do you know? We got our familiar islands again, our puzzle. Oh yeah, the little light one. This is the one that I saw them do. Uh, yeah, so uh, unlocking the steam engine might... Uh, create new scenarios that I have to encounter. Now, how do I get up there? Oh, do I have to go up this way? Hmm. Have a look. Yeah, I think so. Alright, so let's go up here. And... Can I actually reach that? I can. Let's save on these hooks, because I only have... I only have 30 of them. Okay, so let's, let's have a look here. Can I reach that? No, I can't. But I'll go down to there. And then I'll go up to that one. Yeah. There's no point in me being down there. Unless I have to be on the other side. But let's have a look in here. And I don't think there is anything of interest. Probably gonna be the same where I have to get the other one. down over there but I did see that beam of light over there so maybe that's where I gotta go uh, let's uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna cut here so you don't have to watch me miss and waste all my hooks and I'll bring you back when I'm there and here we are so yeah this is what I saw them do basically I gotta take these beams and I gotta aim them at the sphere or the sphere or the totems not 100% sure, let's grapple onto here. No, what was it? Hold E. And then... I think it was into one of these or... At the sphere. Let's try the sphere. Alright. Go to the next one. I had to itch my nose there, that's why I thought Must is a little off. Oh. No, I do have to. Wait a minute. No, I can't rotate these. Hmm. Okay, this is a puzzle, alright. Okay. Let's check this one. Let's see where, what I do with this one here. Oh, yeah. I think that's 
what I have to do. I have to light them all up or something. Hmm. Something like that. Alright, uh, let me figure this out and I'll bring you back. Okay, we're getting somewhere. I'd, uh, mess around with these guys here. I had to aim that one over here. The one inside here, I had to angle over here to bounce off of here. We turned this one on. And then I believe this one. We gotta. Gonna move. There, because I can't go up and down with this one. Hmm. Okay. So there's gonna have to be another one then. Somewhere. Uh. Yeah, that's powering that one. Uh, this one over here. Go check this one out again. Ah, I didn't see that down there. I was aiming for the, uh, the actual uh, thing about water. Yes, that thing. Now, if I go down here, because this one has two, go ahead and rotate it, because I'm just rotating the top, and that should be it. Uh, something's not right here. Hmm. Missing something. Get it all lit up. I'm gonna have to investigate. Okay, I'm just triggered. I moved this one off and put it back on. It triggered. So let's go get our chest. Go ahead and pick that up. That's on our back. And I was wondering, I was hoping I'd be able to find one of these um, chunks of ice or coal around here, but I have a feeling that might be in the the next segment. And that's what I mean. That's what I was referring to because I had unlocked the uh, the driller. So these, since I unlocked it now, then it will show up after the next um, after the next depot. You know, I almost thought I had something to do with that, but that's not the case. Anyway, I'm gonna work my way back to the train. We got what we came for, and we'll find out what we got inside at the, the next depot. Oh, there we go. One of these magical chunks of ice. Just happens to have fireflies. Come on, uh, pick it up, pick it up. Ah, too far. I'm too lazy to go back down there. Get it going again. That works. A lump of ice. Alright, let's go check this out. I might as well grab the scrap all over here. Uh, that's what we built the big machine at the back for. Wow, I'm finding lots of scrap. Oh, ow. Hole. Oh yeah, that's right. That's uh, ow. Uh, hang on a sec. Uh, where did the chest go? <gasps> oh. <laughs> uh, let's go take care of that. <laughs> yeah, I'm laughing. Okay, uh, let's place this down. Uh, F. We learned something today. See, I figured stupid things. See, and that doesn't go in my backpack for some reason. Oh yeah, because I've got it equipped. 
I was under the impression that I could carry two big things. One on my back, one in my hand. Apparently not. Alright. Let's see what we can do with this thing. Okay. Can make ice. Oh, wait. A large vessel filled with service water. Yeah, so that's for, uh... <sighs> for the, the engine. Cold crushing. Alright, well, let's see what we get out of this. Is it something hit me or is that this thing? Three dirty ice. Okay, I'm not complaining with that. I can't. There's no point. Alright, so that is that. So, um... Yeah, anyways, I, I saw that little twinkle up in there, so I thought, bring it back, bring it back for that. So anyways, I uh, continue on. Oh, look, I found another one. Found a lump of coal. Cool. <laughs> it scared me. <laughs> That's something hit me or something, just the sound of it. All right, so we have a lump of coal. Now, the coal I know we're going to use for fuel. Uh, let's see what we got of this. I think we'll get the same three pieces. Three coal chunks. And I can, oops. I can use that for fuel, so that's always good. And I can use that for uh, the coal briquettes, which I think we need for the, the the locomotive. But anyways, continue on, and I will hopefully see you at the dep depot pretty soon. Okay. Well, it, as you can see, it's a little cloudy, but as you can hear, we are here. So I stop the train for now, uh, just for a second, take care of a few things before we go. I also want to make sure I'm armed because I have a feeling there's going to be a bit of a standoff here. So maybe, j just maybe, put my fuel into the furnace first. Go ahead and do that. Oh, and uh, oh, I need more wood. Hang on, hang on, hang on. We gotta take care of my vitals, put that away. Uh, Alright, and go ahead and do this. Alright, now, do I need to eat? Yes, we eat. And I should have iron on me. Okay, so uh, let's make one of those plates. Uh, no, I wasn't here. Where was it? It was not there. Okay, let's make one of these. Just because. I have a feeling things are going to go terribly wrong here, and we'll find out what happens when we die. Do I need to make a bed? Alright, uh, what do I do with this thing? Ah, there we go. Hey, you can use stuff. You can right-click stuff. There we go, I have armor. I had no idea. Interesting. Oh, uh, I saw the compass. I thought it was a health bar. All right. I guess. Oh, oh, oh that's the rotten. Not gonna save my life. That will. Uh, I'd like to make the other gun. I got all these parts in here, oh, and there, and there. Uh, but I need, if I know that if I actually make a gun besides this one here, then I actually have to pay for the ammo. Or make the ammo. Anyway, I'm sorry if I hit you. Unintentional. Okay. And dramatic reveal behind the fog. I know here I can see the ribbons, I just can't see it. Oh, grab all the scrap I can. I'm gonna be foraging to the very last breath. So what, are we actually here or what? I gotta grab that scrap. Getting greedy here. Got upgrades to do. 
Oh, look at that. There's another one over there, too. Okay. Oh, one more. And... Oh, look at this. Another ice chunk, too. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, gotcha. Gotcha. Oh, I can't run with it. Makes sense. Anyway, put you in here and check my inventory. We are good. Okay. Now let's do it. I swear I'm not procrastinating. No, no, no. I'm not dragging this on at all. Oh, gotta get some wood. Gotta get some wood. Need that. Need that. There it is. Alright, I, I, I can see the all-seeing eye off in the distance. And the eclipse of the eclipse. One more. One more. Okay. I swear I'm done now. It's almost like it wants me to go for more. I know I can speed it up. But I won't. Alright. Pistols at the ready. We have arrived at our destination. At a very slow pace. I sometimes think I got a leech on here too. Because apparently they're supposed to slow the train down. Anyway. You ready? No, you're not. What do you got in there? You didn't save any for me? Not very nice. Anyway. Narration, please. I'm wondering if it's getting heavier. I may it would make sense. Yay, we reached the depot, we won the game. Alright. Let's do it. Is there really nobody here? Spoke too soon. I think I made that plating. Where are you? Where are you? Plating really helps. Oh yeah. Being a better shot would do. I've also noticed too with the... Uh, the little, the flocky things. Almost like the, the aiming's off. Yes, I know, it sounds like I'm making excuses, but I'm not. Hmm. Yeah, I never really expected too much shooting in this game. Looks like there's too much recoil on this thing. Wow. I'm a terrible shooter. I'm assuming by the music we're done. Look at that, took no damage. Just one, one armor plate. Now, let's see if we can find some tokens. I'm pretty sure that's going to be the end of them just because the music has stopped. Uh, but you never know. Anyway, I'm going to look around and I'll bring you back when I'm ready.
someone's having a bad day. Oh, that's why his arm's stuck on the floor. Oh, I did find a few things. On a box of armor. Uh, a token and revolver module. That's cool. Uh, they were wearing armor too, and I think it's because I was wearing armor. Because, like he was saying, that uh, uh, it's almost like we're shaping our world. Anyways, enough rambling. I will be right back. Okay, so I went around and didn't really find too much. A few resources and one token. So uh, let's see what we get. I'm gonna guess scrap. Leather. Nice. Anyway, uh, I did find another part on the ground in front of the that box over there. Oh, and another one there too. And looks like there's something up there. No, there wasn't. Yeah, I guess only one coin, so we're gonna take the box in. I'm gonna put these mods away. Or we're gonna find a empty box. And go there. I could probably build a new gun by now, but like I said, we're gonna make ammo for it. But let's pick this up. Because I found the table, it's just over here, and uh, it's a slow, slow, slow process. Alright. And let's see what we got. Oh, ooh. Aha! We got a mushroom. Got lots of stuff. And that full of sp uh, inventory is full again. Okay, by the way, we got another Raflimo too. We'll have to check and see what he's all about. Alright, place you there. Alright, inventory management. Inventory management. Let me do this off camera. Okay, so I was gonna actually look at adding a car. Platform li platform limit reached. Uh, because we're still in the mechanical drive. And then, oh, and then go back here and I try to upgrade. And it won't let me upgrade either. So, I think the only thing I can do right now is actually research the the engine. But first, let's see what the other roughly mode is all about. Take him down. And we'll place him there. And let's pick up this guy. See what he does. They saw one that they, they all have different things. Repairs objects. Interesting. So we have repairs objects. We have... Uh, Oh. Well, I guess we're feeding him. And now you get to see what the mushrooms do. New to... Really? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Uh, new decor discovered. What? What do you mean? What's this all about? Uh... Nothing. Anyway, uh, since we can't upgrade, uh, let's go ahead and research the steam engine and see what it unlocks. So let me see if I can pull this together. I think I can, and I'll bring you back. Okay, I have everything. Also, I have noticed that the quest is not updated yet, and I do not actually see the marker anywhere. Because normally we see the, the little marker, so maybe this is not the depot we're looking for. Maybe not. Anyway research this and see what it unlocks. Smelter 2. Steel bar. Interesting. I'm guessing that's what we need for the engine. Alright, and then zinc. Zinc extraction. Okay. Brass casing. Casting. Economics. Interesting. Very interesting. Anyway, uh, engines. Steam engine. Okay. So I was just basically explaining what I had just done. So, let's actually see what the upgrade costs on that. <sighs> Uh, what do you mean? Oh wait, hold on. Uh, let's see here. Nope. Mechanical. <gasps> oh wow. Oh, that's expensive. 
demolish the old engine. And I'm guessing that's the actual engine there. Oh, well, that looks definitely interesting. Uh, I don't think we're going to be able to do too much until we actually do that. I can't even expand this because I think uh, the actual platform limit is reached. And that's uh, six. Like We're talking like a four by four, two by two. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And then uh, once we build the steam engine, that'll be increased. So I think this is going to be a good place to call it. I know the episode's much longer than it should have been. I haven't actually checked the recording, but... I guarantee it's a long one. But anyways, uh, I think in the next episode we're going to continue on to the next depot. Hopefully that's what we're looking for. And maybe we'll do some more, more exploring, find some more witch puzzles and whatnot. And I think in the next one we're going to try to get this bad boy up and running to full power. Anyways, I thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to leave me a like. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Later.